Coffee for your sweetener, hon? You ain't got any more of that hot chili, do you, sweetheart? Still waiting on the meat delivery. Hope you're not expecting a tip. Now, when have you ever left me a tip? She's leaving today, on foot. Got her guitar and all. It's too far. Go the way you always go. Or just warm that up. Sounds very interesting. Never a dull moment, hon. Oh, hey, Mike, can you make this one to go, please? That time already? Looks like. Something to remember me by. <laughs> but you didn't even finish your meal. Such a waste, too. You know, I'm thinking it might rain tonight. You sure you want to hit the road like this? I mean, I can see if my friend can give you a ride. It never rains in LA. Besides, I'll probably reach the desert before nightfall anyway, so I really don't think it's going to be a problem. Well, maybe you should go to the ladies' room. Just one last time, to be sure. Not a lot of clean places to tinkle off the interstate. You know I just went, tinkle. Wow, I do have some fresh teepee in the back. I'm just gonna put some in your pack. You know? So 
did you learn how to play this thing? Nope. But Benjamin gave it to me, so I'm taking it with me. Who knows, I might have to sell it or something if things get tight. Oh, do you need some money? I've got my bag in the back office. I'm fine. I assure you, really, I am. I'm just thinking ahead, far, far ahead. Besides, if I didn't know any better, which I do, I would think that you were trying to stop me from going. Hello? Hi, Daddy. Yeah, I should be back there by next weekend at the very latest. Yes, I'm being safe. I'm riding... Yeah, I'm riding with friends. Okay, well, I'll call you and check up with you every chance I get, okay? I love you too, Daddy. Bye. Daddy doesn't know I'm hitchhiking. He wouldn't approve. I can't say I'm so keen on the idea either. Every horror movie, well, every one worth its salt. That was some pretty young thing. Hitchhiking it alone across the countryside. Well, lucky for me, I can defend myself. <laughs> but why isn't Ben driving you to the dad's house? Things with Ben ended two weeks ago. I know I told you that. When you missed your period, was that the straw that broke his camel's back? I went out and I bought one of those blue pregnancy test strips, just to be sure. And he came home and he saw the box on the counter and he bolted. He didn't even say goodbye. I assume the test was a negative. Like you'd really let me take the Boot Heel Express halfway across the country if you thought I was with a child? I'd be fine with it either way, hon. Really, I would. Babies are so precious. With their weight in gold. You need a ride, Tuts? Maybe. How far are you going? <laughs> All the way to your toes, if you let me. You think you can afford it? <laughs> I don't know, you tell me. You're the one that's asking for a ride. I've never gone all the way before. Maybe I'll second for a ride to Vegas. Oh, but what if I want to go further? Oh. Oh, it's okay. You're too beautiful to wait. Yo, mame. Yo, some stomach, bitch. Ne, jenom dělám roleplay. Ne, nebudu ti přece říkat všechno, ne. A proč bych ti to říkala, když mám sex s Tomem? Ciao. Thanks, babe. You always ah, tell please, please, please stop. Fine. Please stop. Let's just start from the beginning. She messed it up. Oh, gosh. Can't you just be simpler? Can we just get the hotel room? Just the hotel room. Now listen to me carefully, Woody. Your ex-wife gets the hundred thousand dollars. Don't do you. it! You talking to me or you 
talking to somebody else. Uh, just some poor schmuck stuck on the side of the road, about ready to make the biggest mistake of his life. Don't do it! Good for him. Basically, you have no more appeals left. Yeah. You have 10 days to sign Yeah, I know, I know, I know already. Thank, Thank you, you for nothing. Out. I understand. I'm 45 years old, and I'm flat broke. She gets the recording yeah, studio, the way, she gets the house. My wife is also getting the $100,000 from your IA. You want it all? You want it all, you blood-sucking leech? All right, I'll give it all. You want it all? Here you go. Take it all! Here you go. Suck on that, you leech! Megan, what the hell? Okay, my car broke down. I'm in the middle of nowhere and I'm totally gonna miss the game. So call me back. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Do you know anything about cars? Hell of a bad place to break down. Sucks, huh? <laughs> Could I possibly trouble you for a ride into town? Okay. I just picked it up today. So, is there any chance you messed up at the liquor store? You're no good to me or mine. You're diseased.
should have brought pie. Hello? Somebody there? Hello? This last Hello? Hello? for your supper. Oh, look at this collar. Oh, do you belong to somebody? Do you want one? Okay, but we gotta make them last, all right? This is all I got. Okay. If you come back for more, you have to keep the werewolves away. You serious? I thought you were sexy with your clothes on. Sorry, I thought you knew better. Mm, I thought I did. Did you bring them? <laughs> Baby, did I not only bring them, but I believe you said ribbed, but not lubed. Tell me, what are we gonna do with all these? We're here just for two nights. Then again, my gentleman always comes prepared. Comes! Sheriff. Sheriff's office, I may we serve you. No, ma'am, we are just the field office. Yes, you are the first to call it in. Buffy Pratt, is this new? Yes, it's the fax machine. I'll let the sheriff know. Thank you. She was reported missing by her uncle. He thinks she was a chiki. Oh, no. Oh, and that was Miss Tracy on the phone. She says there's a fire near the Okalishi Road. Well, get the uh, volunteers on that fire. I've got bigger fish to fry here. I do not like the look of this. further away from the highway. Hey kid, car break down or something? Too much to ask for coffee, I assume. 70 plus miles to the next gas station. And Creedy's Farm's back that way, <laughs> quite a bit. I'd be happy to give you a lift. I'm 22. I'm sorry, did I miss something? 
I'm not a kid. I'm 22. Are you part of a search team or something? Because I don't want to hold you up. Oh, I'm just putting up some flyers. Trying to do my part, you know. Well, I hope they find whoever they're looking for. I have some baby wipes. You want to clean up before you hit the road? Five dollar cash and money. I ain't really got much money, man. Oh, how cute. <laughs> Princess. Oh, yes. I know you're thirsty. You are correct. <laughs> a hard candy shell earlier. I mean, you never can be too cautious. This poor woman, her family must be scared half to death. You were a uh, Marines? Navy Corpsman. That's a meta traveler. Colorado by way of Nevada. You? Reno, eventually. What's in Reno for you? Pick up my paycheck from the night shipper comes from Mexico. Do you work in Mexico? Oh, I work all over. Wherever there's work. But my, my check, it always comes from Mexico. Seatbelt, safety first. Poor puppy. Now that is the funny thing about a puppy. It takes a village to raise a little girl, but all it takes is an old truck and a puppy to get one. is a booming. <laughs> now, Mrs. Slim, she insists I keep everything on a strictly professional level. But you're not even a person or anything. I am a person. Why would you do this to me? Hey! I'm talking at you! Hey! It's for horses. 
smoke? What is that? One thing I learned in the Corps, nothing stinks like people. You gotta keep them on ice. Can't let the meat spoil. If you're looking for a ransom, my parents, they don't have much money. Ransom? If that's what you thought. No, honey. No ransom for you. Help! Somebody help me! Now, I do not want to have to carve out that fucking tongue, but I certainly will do it. I'll do my job and you do yours, and your job is to keep fucking quiet. Are you going to kill me? <laughs> Let's just sit here and make quiet and not worry about what we can't control. I don't want to die. <laughs> Doctor! Hey, Migo! I am Hungarian, you idiot. I don't speak the language. You got my money? Dinero? Is I the donor anemic? Not that I can see. I got O positive and A positive on the menu today. dehydration, the toddler was fine, according to ER doctors. The sheriff says Amanda's mother, Angela Sherwood, who was last seen with her daughter and at the same park, has not been located as of this broadcast. Sheriff Marks also stands by his claim that there was no sign of a struggle, and even though state officials and the FBI have asserted that they wish to question Sherwood's husband, Marks says 31-year-old Theodore Hawkeye Sherwood is in fact not a suspect. Gentlemen, get me the file on the mother, please. There's more pictures coming over the fax line in just a minute. Okay, thanks. And there's coffee. You don't have to buy me coffee. Thank you. Yeah, no, I found her at the uh, old oil field park. No, there's no sign of foul play outside of the mother Angelica being MIA. No, I had her husband in custody, but he's not our culprit. No, no, I won't. Look, he's not our bad guy. You can print whatever you damn well please. Okay, look, as soon as I find something out, you'd be the first to know, all right? Damn press. Son of a bitch! Sheriff, the volunteers found human remains in that fire. I know, Virgil called me on my cell phone. I'm sorry you had to hear the gory details on that one, Jenna Lee. Her name was Pepper Nixon. She was a cheerleader from Dempsey. Eric Lawson found a car about two miles up the road. The coroner's going to get your full report on Monday. That makes three dead girls. Three dead, 12 missing that we know of. Looks like we're gonna burn the midnight on this one.
So for you, we wait. I don't know what you want from me. That's for the good doctor to decide. Can I have some water? I'm really <laughs> thirsty. You'll thank me later if I decline. Doubt it. What'd you do for a living? Back in the world. What? You got nice boots, expensive guitar, must work. Guitar was a gift. Boots I got from a thrift store. I got my last vehicle from the Good Wish. $600, cash and money. Why did you put a needle in my arm? I had to know your blood type. A positive. Oh. Your HIV negative, by the way. You drew my blood? This isn't a hospital. You're not a doctor. This isn't sterile. What did you do to me? The police are going to find you and you're going to go to prison. Don't test me, you little bitch. You're crazy. Won't do you no good to smooch my butt, darling. <laughs> In some hostage situations, the captor and his prey grow close together, develop sort of a personal relationship. They call it Stockholm Syndrome. That won't be happening between you and I, darling. Oh, what did he do? She's safe and sound, right where we left her. <laughs> Where's her baby? Toddler, huh? Now, if she had been healthy newborn, my money'd been made for the year. What kind of answer is that? Where's her baby? I'm beginning to tire of your attitude. All I'm asking is, is her baby gonna be okay? That's none of my concern. Yes, I do. Her name's Dee. Dee Narrow. Showtime, kiddo. Not for you.
Oh, honey, I'm home. Amanda, Sergio, what are you doing? What am I doing home early? Surprise! This is what you get for taking all my fucking money. I can take everything fucking away from me. <sighs> but you didn't get my weed. Yeah. That bitch. You showed me shake. Can't get a break. <sighs> Fuck. I'm too stoned. <laughs> God damn, a shooting star. All right, let me wish. I wish I had a big dick. I wish I had a new recording studio. And I wish I had a woman with natural tits. That'd be nice for a change. Didn't work. Bugga, 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 bugga. Good luck getting it now, bitch. Good luck getting it now. <laughs> Eric Lawson, what can I do you for? Hey, Sheriff, you still paying cash for tips? Well, well, hold on there. Let me be the judge of that. First of all, how are you and your mom getting along, okay? No, mama's got the gout with that little diarrhea with corn in it. <laughs> well, I'm sorry to hear that. Now, I surely will be out there right soon to visit. So, Eric, what about this tip? No, I wasn't aware of it. Your cousin, you say? Not one delivery. Now, what diner are we talking about?
piece of shit car broke down. Oh, no. I'm definitely not gonna wait for you. Maybe some nice trucker could give me a ride back. My shorts? Oh, they're short, sweetie. You can't even know what to do. You don't even take care of it. And look what happened. I'm stuck now. <laughs> At least I got my weed. Ah, uh, yes. What the fuck? That motherfucker saw me shake. Fuck. Well, at least I have my booze. Ah. Uh. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Please help what? Me. What? Help you? Are Please you alright? Help me. You need a He's... first aid kit? Jimmy, Whoa. he's crazy. Do you, do you have a phone? Do you have a, ra a radio? Yes, I got or... a phone. Listen, relax. Who's after you? It's a man. He kidnapped me. There's another woman, too. What? Okay, look. Let's, come here. I want you to sit down over here. Okay? No, no, no. What? He kidnapped me. He's about a mile and a half okay. back, and there's another right. woman. She's going to die if we don't do something. We All right. have to go. Here, here. Dial 911 right now. Hold on. Where's he coming from? Has he got a knife? Does he got a gun? Is there a I don't know his gun. I don't know. He has... Just dial 911. Uh, dial 911. Oh my god. Hello? Hello? You lost signal. What? Oh my god. Did you get through? Your stupid phone's not working. Yeah, it's, listen, listen, you got through. It's got a GPS on it, and they'll pick us up, and they'll come out here. Okay? When you dial 911, that's what it does. Come here, stand up. Stand up, come on. Come on. And look, no, there's no, no, nobody. No. We have to go to the house because there's what another house? woman and she's gonna die. Nobody's gonna. Okay, look. No, it's that way. Okay, look. We can't go anywhere now. It's pitch dark. We're not gonna find anything. How did, okay? how did you get here? Do you, do you have a car? Of course I have a car. What do you think I came here on a camel? I got a car. It's up there somewhere. But it's so fucking dark right now. Just relax. Okay? I'm so scared. It's all right. I'm not going to let anything happen to you. Okay, I got an idea. I got some weed. It's not much, but it'll take the edge off. Let's have some weed. Come on. This is good stuff. Look, lady, I don't even know your name. What's your name? Sally. Okay, Sally. I'm Woody. Come here. Stand up. You got something in your arm. We're gonna get that out, okay? He took my blood. He took your blood? He took my blood. He took your blood. Okay. Come over here and sit down. Okay? And then we're gonna take that thing out of your arm and I just want you to relax. I'm not gonna let anything happen to you. Let's let's take this out. Let's be real careful. Okay? There's an elder woman in the house. Let's not worry about that other lady right now. You're here and you're safe. And that's all that matters right now. I promise you. We're gonna get the rangers. They've got guns and they got dogs and helicopters and stuff. And we'll find that lady and she's gonna be safe too. You just gotta have faith, okay? You're gonna be all right. You're safe now. You're totally safe now. I'm not gonna let anything happen to you. Right, come on. Take a deep breath. It's okay, but just get this thing off. This just looks nasty. Okay? Fuck here. Fuck. Wrap this around here. We're just gonna wrap this up here. 
and you're gonna be safe. Now the rangers are gonna come. There's nothing we can do right now because it's pitch dark. We can't go anywhere. But you stay right here in this camp. We got a fire, I got my ax. We're gonna be okay, all right? And I'm just gonna keep calling. Now why don't you go in there and sleep in my tent, okay? All right? It's gonna be all right, baby, come on. Come on, it's all right. I've been through worse. You ever been divorced? That's worse than murder. Come on, we're just trying to make you laugh, okay? It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna sit here. I can't afford to sleep, okay? I'm so broke right now, I can't afford to sleep. So I'm gonna stay up all night and I'm gonna watch. You need to get some rest. And as soon as the sun comes up, we're gonna head right to the ranger station, okay? You want to stay out here with me? I want to talk. Okay, you can talk if you want. Come on over here. Come on, sit down. Sally, right? You name's Sally? Alright, Sally. It's okay, baby. Don't worry. Listen, I just this is for our protection. And you don't you don't want any of that weed, huh? Fuck it. It's shake anyways. And you're divorced? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> the wife got the recording studio. She got the house. She got the boat. She got the dog. And she got Sergio. She got everything? She got everything. A hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> Good luck getting it now! I could laugh at it now. You're gonna be all right. Now tell me where you're from. I'm from Colorado. What kind of music you like? Any kind? I know. Listen, baby, I'm just trying to get you to get your mind off of things right now, okay? So tell me about Colorado. Tell me about Colorado. Mm. What was it like? Huh? My dad's there. Your dad's there? Yeah. I know, he'd be happy to see you. Will you are you going to see your dad? Yeah. Yeah, okay. That's cool. Listen, you're gonna be okay. I know it was a really frightening experience that you had happen to you. But you gotta trust me, you're gonna be okay. Look at me, look at me. You're okay. Look, I'm gonna let you wear my hat. That's gonna make you strong, okay? A very strong person gave me that hat once. And he said, wear that hat for courage. So I want you to wear that hat and you'll have courage, okay? Nothing's going to happen to you as long as you're wearing that hat. You're kind of weird, aren't you? <laughs> it's so fucking weird. You remind me of my dad. Oh, thank you. Now, I wish if I'd had a daughter <laughs> that she would have been just like you. Because you look like you're a good person. Okay? I'm really tired. I know you are. Okay, why don't you go sleep in the tent, okay? You it's think gonna it's be safe? it's gonna oh, are you kidding? It's gonna be light in just a few hours. Really. Come on. Come on in the tent. Come on. And everything's gonna be okay. Keep the hat with you. And you wanna take the flashlight too? Take the flashlight with you. Now keep that arm elevated up over your heart, okay? Okay. Because then the, the bleeding's gonna stop. Just get in here and just lie down. It's gonna be sunlight real soon, Sally, okay? And then we're gonna go right to the ranger station. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Everything's gonna be okay. I'm gonna keep watch. <laughs> it's gonna be okay. <laughs> All right. You can leave it half open there so you can see I'm right here. Not the perfect cherry on top of the fucking sundae. Yeah, you come in here, camp, Mr. Fucking Maniac. I'll chop you up the bits. 
Watch out for me. I'm trained. Axe deodorant. Axe the television series. Axe the serial. Axe the murderer. Ask me how I'm feeling. I'm pretty high, actually. Okay. Oh my God, you really are freaked out, huh? Oh my God. Hey, look, I'm I'm just walking around trying to get a signal for the phone. Okay. A, a GPS isn't gonna work unless I get signal, right? Right? Let's just go. Can we just go? Let's just grab the hatchet and we can just go. Oh, you are really fucking freaked out, aren't you? I told you everything's gonna be all right, baby. The rangers have got guns, and they've got choppers and dogs and all kinds of stuff. They'll get this guy, all right? We're gonna be all right. We're gonna be fine. You wanna smoke some of this weed I got? You take the edge off. <laughs> oh my God, I'm not gonna let anything happen to you. We're gonna be totally all right. brought him into this, not me. Let's keep that straight, all right? Now, I just assume keep you more peace. But I'll sure as shit pop you in the kneecap if I feel the need. Understand? Did I not make myself perfectly clear? Now look at the mess you've gone and made. <laughs> now, I'm 
expecting a call from my doctor friend. Let me know if you got any need for your vitals or not. Till then, you just sit tight. Now, it's much better to have a bone saw and not need one. Than to need one and not have one. Right? <laughs> If I was gonna kill you just to kill you, you'd be dead already. <laughs> Looks like we're over the truth, little one. <laughs> Ow! Get down. Wrong number. Do a little prepaid job, isn't it? I don't get no nights, weekends, none of that stuff. The phone company. There's your real criminals. Now, if I loosen up that gag, you be quiet. I'd offer you some, but, uh... What's that? It's just camp meat from our friend's tent. Not so? He wasn't my friend. Hmm. <laughs> I didn't even know his name. Hmm. Just... Wrong place, wrong time. <laughs> that all it takes to get a rise out of you? All it takes? You just killed two people right in front of me. Rise. Man's got to do what a man's got to do. I have to support my family. What's wrong? Now, your real money is in spinal research. Stem cells, you know, uh, fresh baby fetuses, embryos. Uh, they're hard to get, though. I would hope so. One time at the abortion clinic in St. Louis, I almost got arrested. We're just throwing them out anyway. That's a nice guitar. You should hold on to this. You should keep it after you murder me. Been a while. train I'm on and they won't know where I've gone We'll rise over. Uh, Everybody uh, off. <coughs> I reckon the 
world's better place with you still in it. Can, can I call my family? I don't think that's best. When I leave, I'll turn your phone on. But you lose your Cali privileges if I even suspect you're you trying won't, to... You won't, I promise. Can I have some coffee? I'll set you up a spot outside. I just, I have to use the bathroom. Well, I hope you're not shy. We had a 911 call last night. The call was too short to get a ping, but we have a number and a name. Let's have it. Woody Busto. No priors, not even a speeding ticket. It was a woman who called on his phone. There it is, Windsor Hills, the forest near the diner. <laughs> nice night, huh? <laughs> hey, what's the thing? Come on. Ah. Now, don't you think if they clean this place up, we could have rented it by now? Huh? Sure, okay. I'll get your stuff for you. Uh, you want a chair to sit on? Thank you. So yourself. <laughs> hey, don't go anywhere now. <laughs> Thank you, Benjamin. <laughs> Babies, Babies are so, so precious. precious. With their weight, weight, gold. You heard me before, but uh, if it wouldn't be too much trouble, if, but you can, you can sit my pack next to me, and I can, I can use it as a stool. I don't need the chair. Um, this is fun.
Good morning. It is indeed a good morning. We got fresh hot chili in the kitchen. Should I have Floyd serve you up a bowl? You know, I'm gonna go with the salad. <laughs> <laughs> 